Hello everyone, welcome to Aglasan. Uh, this video is on the topic of GATE 2021 rank predictor and it will not just talk about one rank predictor but we'll talk about the multiple rank predictors and which one you should use when and how to use them. So first of all I'd like to uh, give a shout out to the fact that your response sheets are already out. If you have not yet downloaded them please go to the GATE online application processing system and download your response sheet. Now once you download them you will notice that in the response sheet you can see the question and the uh, what was the answer that you had marked in it. Now right now students across India are trying to figure out their marks on the basis of the response sheet but the biggest question in front of them is that they don't know which are the one mark question and which are the two mark question. So even when you are using the rank predictors at this moment, there is no knowledge of which are the one mark questions and which are the two mark questions. So I am not sure how the rank predictors that are available online are, you know, figuring out how, how are they giving you the rank there. But as far as I have read through some of their posts and uh, tried to understand what the rank predictor, you know, working methodology is, I think they are trying to see which are the easy questions and which are the hard questions and giving one and two marks accordingly. So again, if you are using any of the rank predictors online, keep this in mind that nobody in the market at the moment can predict your rank very accurately because there is no idea which are the one mark questions and which are the two mark questions. Still, let's not get too pessimistic. I'll uh, tell you which are the rank predictors which are available online right now, which is the best one and how you can use all of them and what should be your next steps. So I am also giving you the link of this article in the description below from where you can access all of the available rank predictor links. So the first most popular rank predictor for GATE 2021 at this moment is the one by Made Easy. Made Easy is a very popular coaching for GATE candidates. Uh, besides GATE, they also give coaching for other exams that are related to this. And I'm very sure you, a lot of you might have already used the rank predictor because I could see that the topic was really trending yesterday. But uh, a lot of you could not use it because I think at least till midnight or something the rank predictor was not working yesterday. But now the rank predictor is working. And I'll tell you why it is really popular is because it is the only one in the market right now that is allowing you to predict your rank based on the response sheet. And how you have to do it is like this. So you go to this page gatrankpredictor.madeeasy.in and here you click on this check now button. Now on the next screen, they will ask you to sign in with Google. Now I'm very sure all of you have a Google ID, so it will be very easy for you. If you don't have a Google ID, please create a Gmail ID and then you can sign in. There is no other way to sign in to this rank predictor. So once you click on the sign in, they will ask permission. So I'm signing in with my account. Now once I am in, it is asking me to select the stream. Now uh, you will observe that it is giving you the option of 8 streams. Civil, Mechanical, Electrical, Electronics, Computer Science, Instrumentation, PI and Chemical. Uh, but right now 3 of them are not working. So at this moment when I am shooting this video, only 5 course rank predictions are open but very soon they are going to also start it for I and PISCH. So if you are a candidate of civil, mechanical, electrical, electronics or computer science, please go ahead and use this, uh, this you know, this rank predictor right now. And if you are an I and PICH student, you will have to wait for a few more hours for the rank prediction to start working. Now say for example, if I click on ME, then I have to click on next and then I have to select the session of my exam. So say for example, if my session was 4 noon, I would have selected 4 noon, then clicked on next. And here they are asking me to put in the URL of my response sheet. So if you are a little confused about this step, don't be. All you have to do is go to your GOAPS, get your response sheet and then put that link here. The response sheet of yours that is opening. Now how Made Easy is actually, you know, predicting your rank. This they have clarified in their... Uh, blog post and I've gone through it and I'll just tell you what they are doing is that uh, Made Easy as a coaching center their teachers have solved all the papers so all the options that you see here 
of civil and so on and so forth for them MADC has solved all the papers and when you are putting in your response sheet they are matching your answers with the answers that they have solved so please keep in mind that this rank prediction is not as per any official key or anything it is as per the solutions that MADC has provided and the same thing has been done by the rest of the rank predictors that you come across so and also they are doing a real-time assessment so I'll tell you in layman terms what the real-time assessment means if there are 1000 students who have taken the the civil engineering paper and only one of them are putting in their response sheet in the rank predictor then the rank will show as not one right but if all thousand of them are putting in the response sheet then your actual rank will be shown so this is a very dynamic real-time assessment sort of thing that is happening but considering that uh, a lot of students are actually using this rank predictor tool you will get a fair idea of where you will stand but yes please do keep in mind that these are all very uh, uh, as per coaching center basis and not your actual rank so don't take any steps on the basis of the rank that you see in these rank predictors so that being said made easy rank predictor so if you were only here in this video to understand how to use the made easy rank predictor this was it uh, once you enter your response sheet you will get your rank prediction you can in fact i would recommend that if you are using this tool once come back after a few hours and try it again because then your rank would be shown differently now this is important for you to note because like i just said every time a new student is entering the response sheet a new data is being generated in their backend and your uh, rank as per all the students who are using the tool will be generated so if you are seeing your rank as say 100 right now maybe after six hours it could become uh, 200 because the rest of the students have also now inputted their response sheet so this is how you use the made easy rank predictor tool now the second most popular or maybe uh, the ones that students were asking us for was the IES master rank predictor IES master IES master is also one of the popular coaching institutes and so till yesterday this predict my rank button was not available but today it is uh, when you click it you will be asked to enter your email id if you're already an ies master student then also you'll have to enter your email id in either case so first of all you enter the email id so say for example if the id that i am entering is and when i enter it now i will be asked to select a paper so at this moment IES master is only allowing you to predict the rank for CE that is uh, civil engineering and session is afternoon maybe after a few hours you will get the rank prediction for other papers as well now when I click on the next button now here it is asking me to enter the response sheet URL I'll tell you so a, a, a little while back when I was trying this tool it also asked me to enter my mobile number uh, now it is not so maybe when you log in it might ask you your mobile number uh, but again so a little while ago I also said that MADC is the only one that is allowing you to use the response sheet URL but right now IES master is also doing that so kudos to IES master uh, a little while ago this was not available but now it is so if you have your response sheet with you you can use made easy as well as IES masters rank predictor tool right now and predict your rank again the same thing would apply in IES master also that uh, you know uh, the method that they are doing is that the expert faculty have solved all the questions and you they are matching the answers with their solutions against your response sheet to calculate your marks you can also call on their number if you want to understand anything or want any clarification uh, how predictable would be the rank so they are uh, saying that the rank predictor does not show a single rank it is predicted as a range of expected gate rank so they will not tell you that your rank will be number one or number two or it will be 100 or 200 they'll give you a range you know like your rank would be within first to tenth or it will be within the first you know 500 to 1000 or things like that the which they claim would be very close to your actual gate rank It's a very good thing that they have given these FAQs because you need to solving a lot of your queries beforehand. 
the other thing that they are saying is that the IS master gate rank predictor will show a candidate's gate rank only after data for at least 1000 candidates in each set is available. Now this is very interesting and why I would like you to pay attention to this is that it is a very credible way of predicting your rank. They are saying that when at least 1000 students of that particular set enter their response sheet only then we are going to show you your rank. Otherwise like I just said what will happen is that if you are the only student they will say your rank is 1 you will be very happy and but that will not be an actual you know assessment of what your rank could be. Uh, but what they are saying is that when 1000 students enter the data only then we will show you your rank which is a very good thing. They, uh, they will not uh, you know misguide you by showing you a very inflated rank. Oh another good thing is that they are also using uh, normalization. So for all the papers where there were multiple shifts normalization would be implemented. And the last question that they have answered is that if you are seeing different rank each time that is because it is giving you result as per a real time database which I just explained to you what a real time analysis means. So I have answered uh, I have tried to explain to you about made easy as well as IES master answer key. But besides them also there are more answer you know rank predictors which people are trying to use at the moment and I would like to give you a quick glimpse at them. One is the rank predictor by ICE gate institute. So ICE Gate Institute is also one where you go to uh, get coaching on IES and Gate and all the PSU entrances. So in their rank predictor you have to enter your you know your details. Uh, and your email ID. See I am uh, doing this so that you know you don't have to waste too much time and you can directly decide which one to use. Now the thing in the ICE rank predictor is that they will not uh, give you a rank based on your response sheet. They are directly asking what is the score that you are expecting and accordingly they will give you uh, your expected rank. So this is interesting uh, say for example if I put in maximum score as 100 and I submit it. So the next thing they will do is that they are saying that at 100 rank your predicted gate score is this obviously I mean if I get full um, marks my score would be within this and I will be ranking in the top 1 to 20 that's very good very nice and uh, th the good thing in the ICE uh, rank predictor is that it is also giving you college prediction. Now I don't know whether Made Easy and uh, IES is doing that but in the ICE Academy ICE which link you will get here they are also giving you a college prediction. So this is a plus point. So if you also want to know your predicted college you can use this but try to be uh, you know or know beforehand that you can't use your response sheet for this you will have to enter your expected score. So these are all the you know the PSUs where I can get or the colleges where I can get admission. So that's a good thing. Now the next rank predictor which uh, candidates were asking us about was about the gate academy one. The gate academy is also a popular coaching institute. In this also you will have to register. So in all of them you will have to register in some form or the other. And in this one also you will have to enter your marks out of 100. So whatever score you are expecting you will have to enter that. Before that you have to select which was your session. So if I say this and my marks say if I say 98 and I submit it. Oh, so my score has loaded. Okay. So it is somehow saying my AR would be 0 and my score would be 1066.86. I think uh, I think there is some problem in this. Yeah so it is showing uh, so the page won't reload you will have to see this section. Here they are so, uh, saying that against 85 marks your score would be around this and your AIR would be this which is very nice. And apart from this they have given some post gate guidance videos and PSU job explore opportunities. So you can use all of this but again here, this one you cannot use with your response sheet you should have an idea of your score and then use this. So these are the ones which have already uh, launched their rank predictors. Now there are 
three other names of institutes for which candidates are eagerly waiting for their rank predictors to launch i'll give you a quick glance at what is happening there so the first is about ace academy ace is a very again a popular academy for gate aspirants but unfortunately they have not yet launched a rank predictor if they do we will update the link on this article but as of now there is no 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 there is no rank predictor yet they have given you answer keys and everything so maybe you can use the response sheet and answer keys and try to figure out your score the sec other one is creatrix creatrix has also not launched any rank predictor that i can find out on their channel sorry on their <laughs> website so no they have also not launched any rank predictor yet gate overflow was also is also very popular amongst gate aspirants and they are trying to figure out when the rank predictor would be out so the website is not loading here right now but the last i saw there was a lot of discussion on the channel on when would the rank predictor be out and all that i think maybe by today or tomorrow gate overflow will release the rank predictors but right now no there is no rank predictor in fact i think there is so much traffic on the website that it is not loading properly but yes this is also one of the very popular rank predictors and if gate overflow does release a rank predictor i would recommend that you go and try it out so that's it guys that's it about all the rank prediction and i hope that the rank predictors show you a good rank and an accurate rank but uh, do keep in mind that uh, right now nobody knows which are the one mark questions and which are the two marks question so therefore there would be a little difference not in fact there could be a lot of difference in what you see in the rank predictors and what the actual ranks come out to be other than that i'd like to give you the good news that iit bombay has announced when it will release the answer key iit bombay has said that the official answer key will be out on 2 march so i'm giving you this link also in the description below come back here on 2 march and check out the official answer key uh, with it the master question paper will be released where it will be clear to you which are the one mark questions and which are the two mark questions so that's it i hope this answers a lot of your queries and i hope you all will be now able to decide which rank predictor to use and how to use them and if you have any questions do ask me in comments below uh, i think your biggest question would be that this is my rank which will be the college that i can get for that i would recommend you to go through some of the past year cutoffs of the colleges and you can ask me the questions in the comments below and we'll try to answer you to the uh, best accuracy possible that's it guys bye oh uh, do like share and subscribe